hey you guys welcome back to another video if this is your very first time here with us go ahead relax stick around become part of our family and if you are oldie but goodie hey all right so i went to the doctor's office today so today i am going to give you the 36 week update all right so i put the notes in my phone and hopefully I look okay um, I tried to come down give you guys another view lately I've been doing videos in the office so hopefully this whole setup looks good um, I don't know why the background looks so washed I don't know Ugh, I hate that all right we just gonna do we just gonna do what it do all right so let's see first things first oh and make sure you stick around to the end of the video so i can give you a baby bump view all right so 36 week update um i'm still going to the restroom constantly i go to the restroom probably i said i was gonna count but it's usually every 30 minutes or so and even more so at night but um i do try to keep my water handy but i stay going to the restroom let's see next up i'm still taking my magnesium for my restless leg syndrome um speaking of i need to go get some more because i only think i have five pills left but i do take um not magnesium citrate <clears throat> but the other one um i try to take that kind of around four or five ish so it'll kick it so make sure it kicks in enough um so i don't have to be bothered with it at night um let's see next so a new update a new not update but a new symptom is insomnia that i've been dealing with so the insomnia can come from different things not being able to have a full night's sleep which the restless leg, constant peeing, you know, I didn't mean to say pee, <laughs> but going to the restroom. Um, so I think mine is a mixture of going to the restroom and then I just can't fall into a deep sleep. So <clears throat> I try to go to um, sleep around nine, but lately I just sit there, toss and turn. Um, since I can't fall asleep, I get on my phone then i go use the restroom come back get on my phone try to go sleep gotta go use the restroom so from 9 to 12 in the morning i go use the restroom probably six times and then i'll fall asleep about one o'clock in the morning so um so um at the doctor's office today at my appointment i did ask him um what can i do for that and he said to take that i could take tylenol pm or benadryl so i'm leaning i really don't want to take anything but um if i do i'm leaning more towards benadryl because i hear so many commercials that's uh, online if you've taken tylenol and your child has autism i'm like oh my gosh so if i do anything i'm leaning more towards benadryl and it probably won't be every night um all right so at my appointment today um i got on a scale i was 163 so i've lost a pound from two weeks ago i don't know i mean i know my appetite isn't huge but i didn't think i would lose a pound so so i'm 163 my blood pressure was great it was 125 over 64 um so he did do a cervix exam today i have not dilated not one centimeter um so she is still baking my due date is january 31st um i was hoping that i don't have to go all the way to the 31st since we're so anxious to meet her but he was like, you haven't dilated anything. And I'm like, oh my gosh. But I was like, okay, that's cool. Let us keep baking. Uh, let's see what is next. Um, so they did an anatomy scan. So her head is where it's supposed to be. So that's awesome. So she is head down. 
and um, that's good because you don't want the feet first that'll be breech and they may have to do a c-section so so I'm glad she, she is where she's supposed to be she has assumed the position <laughs> um, so now I go to appointment every week you guys so uh, so my next appointment is next Wednesday so um, so we'll see if I come back on and give another update if nothing haven't changed then I probably won't do an update but if I've had some major changes then I probably will um, and he said she is seven pounds so, so he said it could be a little off. So if not, she's six pounds and almost seven pounds. But, but the 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 monitor says seven pounds. So I'm gonna go with that. So she is moving right now. I have been playing. So I went on YouTube and found some um, music. So I've been playing that for her because you all know they say classical music just does something. You know. For their brain it gets them it's really good for for them so so i am going to play a little clip from today so you can see her face um um my daughter and vince had a hard time seeing her face at first and i did too but if you keep watching the video, then you'll see her face pop up. So I'm going to let you guys see um, the ultrasound. I'll come back on and then I'll show you a bump view. All right, let's roll that wonderful bean footage. <laughs> okay. Little pug nose there. That's such Cute little nose and then there's I'm the mouth right there. I'm trying to, I yeah, can't so see it yet. I go like that a little bit. Yeah. Is she looking up? She's looking this way. She's looking at She's, She's looking, looking at me. Oh. There's her mouth, there's her eye, and there's her head. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my god. Well, she can take a picture, girl. Let me see. All right. So, um, so did you see her face? Um, looked like she was like like looking at me like she was trying to kiss me like i'm ready to meet you too baby girl so those are all the um symptoms and stuff that i'm experiencing overall i feel good um sometimes i do need to take it easy like if i'm folding clothes and i'm standing up sometimes i do have to sit down but other than that i'm okay so let me go ahead and stand up and give you guys this, this book view all right. Oh my gosh, it feels so heavy at times. There it is. Boom. There it is. So she is down here where she's supposed to hit that she is she's her face is over here so yeah so that's how it is looking let me zoom out there we go oh goodness gracious front a side view that's how so this is a maternity shirt that I picked up from um, Ross. All right, you guys, I believe that is everything. I just wanted to come on here and give you guys the 36 week update. Thank you so much for following our journey. We really do appreciate it. And I know you guys are excited to meet her as so are we. And I believe that's everything. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.